you know there's a problem with the president when an entire gender marches in protest against him. On January 21st, the day after Donald Trump's election, a, mar a woman's march on Washington took place. The march protested Trump's hateful rhetoric towards women and minorities during his campaign. The protest was against the president himself. It also promoted progressive causes and it sparked a worldwide progressive movement. During the Women's March, people finally started to mobilize against the president the majority of the country did not elect. People are scared of how Trump will impact them and also how he will impact the country and the surrounding world. According to the official website of the Women's March, the rhetoric of the past election has insulted, demonized, and and, and threatened us all. Muslims and others of faith um, um, people who identify as LGBTQIA, Native people, brown and black people, people with disabilities, survivors of sexual assaults, and many communities are concerned and scared. Um, we are confronted with the um, with the question of how to move forward with, um, in the face of national and international concern and fear. Additionally, many people came out to support this march. It was planned by a large number of people. There were independent state coordinators as well as four national co-chairs and a national planning committee and 2.6 people attended these marches all around the world, both in the, in the United States and also 32 other countries. And a variety of causes were represented, not just women's rights. Um, other causes included ending violence, reproductive rights, workers' rights, civil rights, disability rights, immigrant rights, and environmental justice. The march brought a large number of people together because so many causes were represented. And as a result, many people stood together in solidarity. There was a peace march on Antarctica. There was a feminism march in Australia. There was a protest at the American Embassy in Mexico regarding immigration. And many people in Africa and Europe marched as well. People are starting to mobilize and take action against Trump. This was the first of many that will probably come out of this presidency because people are so scared and people are starting to fight for the progressive causes that they lost control over in this election. It's time for the people of the world to come together to save the world from the American government.